With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So here we have a question from the chapter dimension analysis. A dimensionally consistent relation for the volume V of a liquid of coefficient of viscosity eta flowing per second through a tube of radius r and length l and having a pressure difference p across its end is. So what we have been given? We have been given we have to find the formula for the rate of flow of volume per second. So it will be let us say that is v. So it will be equals to k. Multi k is the magnitude or a constant that will come before multiplied by the first term that is eta to the power a. Now the second dependency term that is radius to the power b, the third dependency term that is l to the power c and the final term that is pressure to the power d. So for this equation to be dimensionally correct, the dimension of LHS has to be equal to dimension of RHS. So if I talk about dimension of LHS, it is L cube t minus 1 because it is volume per second and this will be equal to dimension of the constant is 0. So it will be n to the eta to the power a what is the dimension of eta it is ml minus 1 t minus 1 what is eta it is eta is nothing but force per unit area per unit volume gradient the velocity gradient so this is how eta is defined so it is m minus 1 l minus 1 t minus 1 to the power a multiplied by radius that is length to the power b multiplied by again the length that is l to the power c multiplied by the pressure now pressure has the dimension ml minus 1 t minus 2 to the power d so for this to be true the dimension of lhs is equal to dimension of rhs so if i equate the term of mass mass has coefficient 0 on this side so here a plus d will be equals to 0 and this will be our first equation and if i have a look at the term of time so in time t is minus 1 on LHS and it is equals to minus a minus 2d. So if I solve both of these equations what I get my term d comes out to be equals to 1 and similarly as d plus a is 0 so a will become minus 1. So we have found a and d now we have to find out b and c. So if I use the equation of length so LHS is 3 and it will be equals to minus a plus b plus c minus 2d minus d minus 1 into d that will be minus d so if i put in the values d is 1 a is minus 1 so minus a and minus d will cancel out what will be left with b plus c will be equals to 3 now you have two variables and it is not possible to solve this equation furthermore so we'll have to have a look at the given options now in all the options the value of r is either r to the power 4 or r to the power minus 4 so if i take r to the power 4 then b will be equals to 4 so if b is equals to 4 the value of c comes out to be equals to minus 1 so from that relation our option a is satisfying so our option a will be a correct option and if i have a look at taking the value of b to be minus 4 that is in some cases so if I take b minus 4 then the value of c comes out to be equal to 7 that is not present in any of the equations. So only correct option for the given question will be our option a that volume will be equal to pi by 8 that is our constant k multiplied by pressure r to the power 4 divided by eta multiplied by l. Now our why so because our a was equal to minus 1 and what was a? a was eta so eta is minus 1 d was what d was our pressure so pressure is 1 here also pressure is 1 b will be equals to 4 so our radius is has the power 4 and l has the power minus 1 here so l has the power minus 1 here so our correct option is our option a thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today